Okay, hello, this is uh, Dr. Janes, and today I'm going to talk about an issue with uh, ADB or uh, Android uh, Studios where uh, you take your device, you set up the uh, debugging and everything, you think it should work, and so you, you plug it into the USB and you want to try to write your, uh, your programs to it. So you hit play and it says no no device connected. Now this is a this is a lollipop uh, Android uh, version 5. Point something or other. And uh, this is actually the issue here. So let's let's cancel out of this. So uh, what's going on here? We'll unplug that. We'll take a uh, this is a LG Android uh, KitKat version. And we plug that guy in. Okay. And it's we tell it OK to recognize it and we try to hit play and uh, it, it's, it sees a device there so let's let's try to uh, let's cancel out of this so we could we could burn that let's let's go to uh, command prompt and we'll run ADB devices and ADB devices also recognizes it. So let's let's pull that guy again and we'll plug the Lollipop Android version back in and we'll try running ADB again and now it says uh, okay so we ran ADB on uh, the Lollipop device and it, it's just showing a blank there so what's what's going on? What is what's the solution to this? And so the the, the issue is is that you um, okay? So we ran um, we ran ADB on the Lollipop device and it didn't see anything. So what's the issue? What's going on here? And the issue is is that with Lollipop uh, Android version of Lollipop, you have to do the setup a little bit different than from KitKat in order to have it talk to uh, Android Studios. And so let's take a look here. And uh, here is our device. Okay. And if we go pull that down like that, and we look through these little pull-up menus, it says uh, MTP. So we click on that and we need to change that setting to send images PTP. Okay? And then it will ask us about the uh, computer's RSA key, fingerprint, blah blah blah, and we'll say OK. Okay? And once we've made that change, our uh, both programs, ADB and um, Android Studio, should be able to talk to our Lollipop device. Okay. Okay, so now we have our Android uh, Lollipop LG phone hooked up, and we will try ADB again. And this time, we do ADB, it recognizes it. Okay. Now let's go back to Android Studios, and we'll hit the uh, uh, run button and it also recognizes Android 5.0.1 okay so this seemed to have fixed the problem and we're all ready to uh, download Android uh, Java programs onto our device if we want to anyway hopefully this helps this is Dr. James thanks for watching